My name is Mohammed. Apparently, I look like the Australian Idol guy Sebastian. <laughs> mm. I love my religion, Islam, and have been to more mosques than I have the supermarket. Perhaps the greatest influence for me and my family members to becoming hardworking uh, and focusing on education and hoping to be good citizens of this country was the emphasis placed on it by my religion, Islam. I have three siblings who are lawyers, and that made me go mad. I became a psychologist. <laughs> I believe the best way to increase understanding and mutual respect is through interaction. Senator Hansen, I understand you declined Sam Dastyari's offer for a halal, halal snack pack. She's reconsidering. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> With respect to that, would you be willing to take my offer to inviting you for lunch or dinner, whichever suits you best? with me and my Muslim family, and in respect to you and your beliefs, while we have something halal, I'll ensure what you have is something that's not halal. A haram snack pack. <laughs> Would you kindly accept my invitation? That's a kind invitation. Thank you very much. Um, I'm quite happy to spend time with many Australians. And with my one? <laughs> with your haram, what's a haram snack pack? No, he said with anything, his... anything over a, a, a meat and a lunch, a dinner, just so we can uh, increase our understanding. And my offer extends to all people who might be, um, who might dislike Islam and all Muslims. Um, now, Paula, would, 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 no, would this, would, would would this no, okay, sure, go ahead. No, made a comment that mm. I dislike Islam and all Muslims. I, that is not the case whatsoever. Okay. And as I said, I don't I've think you said that Muslims... actually. <laughs> I don't think you said that. What did you say? Okay, let's clarify it. Sure. I said my offer extends to anyone who also might uh, dislike Islam and all Muslims in a in a pursuit to create further understanding. So over any meal, whether it's halal or haram. <laughs> We can talk. You can get in touch with my office. See sure. what happens. Yeah. So, <laughs> it, just, just, um, for you. <laughs> it, it's, it's a nice sort of uh, piece of reconciliation. It's been quite a tough argument. But I'm just so seriously. Would you be prepared to sit down with Muslims and particularly with his family, since he's often, and try and understand things from I, their perspective? Look, I know there are there are people in this country who are Muslims uh, of the Muslim faith hmm. that they want a peaceful life and they want to live without fear. And yes, I think that's wonderful. We are a multiracial nation, but the bottom line is we, that we must be Australian under one culture, way of life, and our laws. Tony, I think the and important I... question is, what's on the menu? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I think he, he mentioned but haram meats, so well, they're not unbelievable. Uh, Tony, I think what Nick, what Nick is trying to say that Nick and I will come round to your place because I'll never say no to a snack pack. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I tell you what, I'm gonna, I think that's a surprisingly optimistic.